can see, I'm with my co-star, Good Guys Chucky Doll. Good Guys Chucky Doll. No, it's just Chucky. We're here with Chucky. He's got a little Chucky mug there. And, well, today, my friends, we're covering very something very, 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 very great. This, my friends, is some Chucky news. It's a new series that I'm starting. So this is season one, episode one. Um, yeah. Let's get into it. So, first thing I want to cover is I did... I didn't get this recently. I got this a while ago. The Child's Play 2019 DVD. I will do a movie review on this if you guys want me to. Okay, now today, topics we're talking about for Chucky News are fan films that are coming up, dolls that you can buy, and some very important news that I am very excited for. So let's just get into fan films. So for the fa first fan film that we have is the all, everybody knows it, Charles. Now I myself am very excited for Charles. Um, I've seen all the little things on their Instagram that they do. It's great, um, yeah. That, this is a film by Tony Biz, I believe. Tony Biz, yeah. Now, another film is Chucky Rising by Nukas2707. I have seen what doll he's using. He's either using the Spirit Halloween doll or the Talking Chucky doll. Like, the, you know, the just this kind of old one. Let me see if I can pull him out. <laughs> this guy, you know. Oh, where's that glare coming from? This guy, you know. Yes, but him, he might use. So that's Lucas 2707's film. Whoa. Well, it turns out Nightmare Crypt is doing a fan film titled Child's Play Revival. Now, I'm honestly very excited. He has the um, John Voodoo doll prop. It's not the actual one, but I'm sorry, I do not know how to pronounce the name. I'm just going to say how I think. Um... I'm just gonna call it P dolls, P dolls. Um, but it's very good quality, very excellent. S Romeos, aka Nightmare Crypt. Child's Player Arrival. Oh, that's my own fan film. You guys can check that out. It's not out yet. We haven't even started filming it. We just gone to locations, done the storyboards, and everything. But Child's Player Arrival. Not revival. Arrival. It's good. We already have the script, it's pretty good. Okay, now the Voodoo Knife. The Voodoo Knife, I believe, is by Tristan's Chucky Collection. I believe that's his name. He has the Michael Lawrence doll's head. Not the actual dolls, those are actually really cool. But yes, those, um, the Voodoo Knife. Now, I do know somebody that has designed a poster, and it's very good. You can check out his Instagram, make sure to follow the official page of fan film. Oh! Now we have something from Iron Dominic Marino. Now he does have a YouTube channel and I'd love if you guys would check him out. He is doing a fan film called Chucky vs. Buddy. Um, I've seen his work, his buddy dolls. I love them. I really wish I won one. But I'll get to the buddy doll I am getting in a second. We also have Vengeance of Chucky, I believe episode three or four it's a very good series i watch it time i watch it sometimes i love um damn dude industries youtube same with nightmare crypt um but yes vengeance of chucky episode three or four so there's all that now we move on to the dolls after i kind of say some stuff about the fan films and my opinions about them so yeah charles i feel that it's gonna be a really good movie, in my opinion. Um, it's just that why I think it's gonna be a good movie is because they're using actual animatronics, not like this guy where he just like turns his head and talks. They're actually using like the original, not original, but like kind of how they did it in the original Child's Play, like how they had like the whole weird little plastic skull. And I would honestly love if you guys support it. Um, they already ended the Indiegogo. I did support it with it because I was very happy ab about the, um... Jeez, guys, I don't know why I keep stuttering in all my videos, but I was very happy about the campaign and how it was going. So, Chucky Rising. Now, Chucky Rising, 
Nukas2707, I've gotten in contact with him. He's okay. He's he's cool. But um, it seems that he's not working on it yet because he has to get this movie he's working on called Don't Watch. The movie looks fantastic, I'll admit. Um, Hereditary was good. Uh, Midsummer was good. And he said it's going to be kind of like that. It's going to be disturbing in some way and you guys probably don't know but i do love disturbing movies such as like the texas chainsaw massacre other things like that um other fan films not fan films okay um could you call pet cemetery disturbing i guess because the kid gets like literally hit with a semi truck but that was a pretty good movie now child's play revival i already said he's got the greatest he's got good props um it's got everything pretty good so I'm honestly really excited for most of these. Child's Play Arrival. I don't want to share too much about that because there is an episode that I'm doing about the fan film. So yeah. Now, The Voodoo Knife. The Voodoo Knife, I feel like it's going to be a good fan film. Tristan's Chucky Collection has modified one of the Spencer's dolls that are a classic. That I honestly have. And I've had that one for like 9, 10 years. Okay, um... Yeah, Child's Play Arrival, I don't want to share too much about it, but yes. The Voodoo Knife. Oh my gosh. I'm talking about the Voodoo Knife. It's kind of hard to see through this mesh that's printed, but yeah. Chucky vs. Buddy, he hasn't really shared much info on it. But we do know that the, there is going to be a really good quality Buddy doll. Um, and I believe he is using this, the Trick or Treat Studios doll. I'm not really that sure. Um, and Vengeance of Chucky, if you guys watch one of Damn Dude Industries videos, I'm not, I think it's like Charles News. Yeah, and it has like a trailer for it, and I saw it, and it looks really good, like Chucky has these superpowers. I'm a bit confused, I guess it's like the Dombala kind of effect, I would want to call it that, the Dombala effect. But yeah, that's it for fan films. So, we're gonna move to dolls, right now. Can I borrow this? Thank you. Let's get a move on. Now moving on to dolls that you can buy. First we have the My Movie Makes Buddy Doll. So, I am saving up for this one so I can get this guy. But, um, if you guys did not win the AMC Theaters one, or the Iron Dominic Marino one, or the Chucky Fan Film one, which... Yeah, but you guys can if you are willing to spend just like $150 more than this guy. Sometimes he raises it, sometimes he drops it to a low price. But if you guys did not know, you can get one on Etsy for like, I believe right now it's priced at $650. And it's a bestseller, so if you guys want a buddy doll, if it were me, I would get one right now. If you have that money. Now... Trick or Treat Studios Seed of Chucky Dolls. Now, again, I'm a bit late on this one. Now, let me say why I did the Buddy Doll is because he recently posted on his Instagram that they all talk. All the Buddy Dolls talk. Now, I contacted him, and he did say all of them come with a box. They all talk. And when they go out of stock, he will restock them. So I'm 100% getting one. I'll do a review for you guys, and I'll do everything with him. I'll do a skit with this guy I have planned. Um... Oh, again, I'm a bit late on all of these, but the NECA dolls. Now, these dolls are made of silicone, and they're from Bride of Chucky. Um, now, a friend of mine did contact NECA to um, see if the fingers were posable, and they did say yes. So, I'm 100% picking up Chucky and Tiffany, and with the Tots seed, I'm not picking up Chucky or Tiffany. I'm picking up just... Glenn. I don't know if I already said that, but let me move back to those so I can get a bit more kind of on them. Chucky's like $700, I believe. Tiffany is like $600 or $500, and Glenn is $600 or $500. Same price as Tiffany, whatever she is. Now, um, you can purchase those guys over at Trick or Treat Studios or Nightmare Toys. Now, I have ordered from Nightmare Toys before. I believe I got this guy from Nightmare Toys. Just because I didn't really have that much on me and I wanted to get something Chucky. And I hear that their website is good and yeah, they are. So I recommend buying those. You can also buy the NECA dolls from Nightmare Toys. Now the NECA dolls, they are 
pricey for about six hundred dollars but for sure i'll do a review on chucky once i get him now i'll get tiffany a bit later but chucky he's my main priority right now because i love chucky you know now let's get Ooh, i already have this one which I already did a review on, which it's my highest views video. And I just want to thank you guys for like, I believe 217 views of this spirit Halloween good guy doll. Um, yeah, that guy, he's worth it. I must say, um, if you are willing to pay around $500 for a replica like this guy, then I'd go to trick or treat studios or nightmare toys to get this guy. But if you just kind of want a cheap good guy doll that you just kind of want a good guy doll for your collection, or just because you're a Chucky fan and you have the movies, you can get him from Spirit for about $90. Talking updated Chucky doll. I do have this. Um, a friend of mine. I have another friend of mine. Not the guy that talked talk to Neck. Talk to Neca. Jeez. Um, it's a different one, but he got me the uh, Talking Chucky doll, which is right there. And I will do a review on him. Well, not the talking one, because I have the older one. Um, yeah, but he's right there. And he's the updated one, and I will do a review on that later. But, he is good quality, I must say. So if you guys are willing to spend about $80 for him, plus tax, um, I'd go for it. He's good quality. Now let's see. Oh! Now, this doesn't really count as a Chucky doll, but I guess it kind of would. It's Chucky. It's like a Chucky, um, head. But, excuse me, jeez. Trick or Treat Studios has officially announced that they are coming out with See to Chucky and Bride of Chucky ornaments. Now, um, I have seen that they come out with a Jigsaw, uh, Leatherface, and, uh, Michael Myers from Halloween 2, and Sam. Little horror ornaments. I do plan on getting Michael Myers and Sam because I'm big fans of both of them. One second. I'm so sorry. I need to change the music back to the thing that I had. So, yeah. Those, I'm 100% getting them. Gonna probably hang them somewhere. But, yeah. That's kind of it for the dolls. So, let's see what else we have on our list. Thank you guys so much. Let's go to the next news that I have that I feel like you guys might like. Let's go. I'm very excited because, well, I'm going to start doing episodes like this with Chucky News each, I'd say, week. Um, yeah, so I'm doing Chucky News every other week. No, yeah, I think I'll do every other week. But also, let me get them from down here. So, I've reached... 11 subscribers, okay? And I know that's not a lot. I know people are like a million, but I'm grateful. I'll make a deal with you guys. If I, if you guys, sorry, get to at least over 70 subscribers by Thanksgiving, I will do a giveaway. Now, this is only if I get like over 70 subscribers on one of these guys. Now, I did make this guy. He's posable. I will do a Child's Play 1988 Good Guys Chucky, and a Buddy. I will do two. Now, where is that hat? Here. I'll put your name in this. What you have to do to win one of these, a Good Guy or a Buddy, is... What you have to do is tell me what your favorite Chucky movie is down in the comments, and why. Also, your Instagram. So if you do win, I can contact you there. And also, what doll you would want. So if you have a piece of paper and a pen, I would write this down. And go in the comments and do it. And I will look in the comments daily and look for it. And I'll write your name, your Instagram. Um, probably just your Instagram. And then I'll write what doll you want on the back. And then it'll go in this hat. And I'll do a live on my Instagram. It is... Unicorn Puppet 4. You will actually see my actual face there. Um, I don't care if you guys see that. But I will do a live in, on around Thanksgiving about a raffle that I'll do. And I'll do two different ones. One, say, okay. So say, what's a Chucky item that I have? 
Chucky Pin 2 and Chucky I4 say Chucky I4 wanted a buddy doll and Chucky Pin 2, I believe I said, wants a good guy's doll. And Chucky Pen 9 wants a good guy doll too. And Chucky Pen Yeah wants that too. So I'd go, oh Chucky Pin 2 has a good guy doll. He won. Oh Chucky Pin 4. He also wants a good guy. Looks like he'd be getting the buddy. So I'd be saying, like, if you want something else, then you're just gonna have to get it. But if you're a fan of the original Chucky, I believe you can contact Yeah, you can contact you can contact me on Instagram and I will take orders of these guys. But it's gonna be only like a couple months that I'm doing. I'm not doing it um year round or like ever. This is like a couple weeks that I'm doing. But this is only after the giveaway, which is after Thanksgiving. Um of these Chucky dolls. If you win, I will contact you on Instagram and I will tell you Hey, you won this, um, you won, say, the good guy doll. What is your address, and I'll mail it to you. Let me put this guy down where he was. You won, what's your address? And you'd say, like, oh, um, 1218 Pennywise Street, or something. I don't even know if that's a street. It's probably not. I just made that up because I see a Pennywise thing. But, yeah, guys, um, you do that. And I'd go to the post office, I'd mail it to you, and then once you get it, you'll have your Chucky doll. So yes, that was my important news. So, let's, um, that's kind of it. So, let's get to the outro. Thank you guys so much for joining us for our Chucky news this week. Me and good guys Chucky greatly appreciate it. If you'd want to see more of this, let me know. Anyways, thank you all so much for watching. And yeah, I appreciate all the support I'm getting. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Chucksters, out. Oh.